Hello and welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Rebirth. On the last on the last run, we played as Eve. On this run, we're gonna do beans. Even beans. And it looks like we start out with the inability to fire. 99 bombs, butt bombs, black bean, regular bean, 9 volts. So we have the bean on every room, basically. That's how we attack. So this will be interesting. We just kind of run up to these guys, bean them, and then uh, then they die. So this looks to be pretty strong, but it's not actually that strong. It's kind of weak. And the reason why it's very weak is because we can't do any other damage. We have to do damage with bombs. On the plus side, though, we can try to, to uh, look at all of the... Find all the secret rooms, I should say. I want the spirit heart, so I will use a bomb for it. The inability to fire, though. Very detrimental on a lot of runs. Look for more secret rooms. I guess I should have uh, tried to use a bomb to enter the secret room instead of trying to uh, just walk into it. Could have saved me a little bit of extra health. Oh well. Gurglings! I got both of them. That's... I can't really uh, have any fault for that. That was exactly what I wanted to have happen. Damage plus HP up does absolutely nothing for me. How am I going to use damage? I can't. Oh. Fart on two of those guys. Use a bomb on these guys. Didn't actually kill him, which is unfortunate. I'll have to use another bomb. I gotta be careful, though. I can't use too many bombs. We gotta save these. These are gonna have to uh, be with us for the entire rest of this run. But this is it for the first floor. Let's move down to the second. So yeah, this looks like it will be a, l a little bit tricky. This is one of the more trickier runs. It really is. I'll learn my lesson from last time. Uh, let's just fart in two of these guys, I guess. Uh, yeah, oh, I should have used the bomb at the top. I need to, I need to like start thinking. Yeah, what am I trying to say here? I need to uh, remember that the the uh, curse rooms, you can actually get into them now. They fixed that problem with the game. Oh, yeah. Just use a bomb. The uh, butt bombs do a little bit of, uh, of Necronomicon type damage, so it's worth it to, uh, to just use a bomb if you need to just do damage to an enemy. Ooh, that was close. Uh, yeah, so the, you know they fixed the uh, the problem with you being unable to actually get into special rooms from secret rooms. So whenever we need to, we can just use a bomb. Hopefully, trying to get a a quarter from these pots, eh, a little bit of extra money is worthwhile too, I guess. And I will use a bomb on these guys. Ideally, I guess you would want to just not use the bombs, the bombs, but I'm I don't have that much patience. Range down. Oh no. What am I going to do? Well, might as well use the bombs in this room because we get bombs back. Go back for the Tinted Rock, I forgot. Well, not forgot, I just saw it only when I left the room. It's hard to see the Tinted Rock in the top right corner of the screen because the map's in the way. Oh well. Angry Spider, kill him. Use a bomb, kill the flies. Look for a secret room, didn't find one. Soup. Same thing here. Well, that fly kind of decided that he wanted to hit me. Couldn't do anything about it, really. This is a little bit tricky. Only one guy left. I'll wait for the bean to recharge. It's almost recharged. Need to save my health. Maybe get a deal with the devil. Although, honestly, what kind of deal with the devil would I want to get here? 
What deal with the devil is there to get here, you know what I mean? One more bomb should do it, but I want to use the bean first. There we go. That was dumb damage. There we go. Yeah, this run is going to be quite difficult, but I think... Uh, just Krampus now. What would I rather have? Would I rather... What am I kidding? What would I rather have? I can't shoot. So a one every six room Krampus is not going to be all that useful for me. I kind of have to stick with the bean. If I had a familiar, then I could, you know, choose something. Oh. And I get Lump of Coal, so it doesn't actually help me out at all. Man, hopefully I don't only have to go to the mom's foot fight. I didn't actually check, but that is indeed the case. Honestly, the bean is one of the more difficult runs, and it's primarily just because you can't actually attack. <laughs> All right, so this is a a bedroom, and it is just a passage down. Honestly, let's take it. Why bother? You know, if we can get down to mom's heart with, or the mom's fight with this many, oh, careful, this many bombs, I think we'll be able to complete the fight no problem. How are you not dead? I'm gonna poison him. I'm gonna, I'm gonna wait. I'm patient. There we go. Ah, okay, that was dumb, but I kind of got stuck on the, uh, oh, that was just my fault. These guys. Yeah, because at least with Solar System, you can do damage. Oh my god, such bad damage. At least with Solar System, you can do damage whenever you want just by running into enemies. You can use your orbitals. But right here, like, holy shit. You can't actually fire. You have to wait a good 20 seconds for the uh, fart to be ready. So you're not, you're not doing a lot of damage. Oh my god, this room is going to get out of here. Get out, get out. Okay. I was actually worried that room would kill us. And on this room, I'm just gonna use bombs. How many? Three bombs? I'll use three bombs. It's worth it. Health. Tammy's head. Is it better than the bean? Let's try it. We won't have it for one room because I, I used it. I was just kind of testing it, but... Is this better than the beam? It might be. Oh, well, we might just actually die. So uh, let's go ahead and use the bombs. Pick up a lot of health, that's nice. Are you a wizard doesn't do shit. I mean, it does a lot of damage, but it's I think it's compar comparable to the bean. The only difference is that we don't have to actually be right next to an enemy in order to use it. So I think it might actually just be better. It gives us a um, better opportunity to synergize as well, which I think is worth it. Now we have plenty of money. We can go to the shop on the next floor. Yeah, like it's, uh, it killed them a lot quicker than the bean and you can do it from afar. So maybe this is better. Maybe this is. All right, well, thank you for nothing. Okay, I just keep walking right into the uh, into the shots there. I guess it's a little bit more accurate to use the bean because uh, I might just die, actually. That'd be uh, very awful. Yep, there we go. Oh, we got the broken onk. Ooh. Okay. We might still have a chance at this. Careful. 
full. Gotta not take stupid damage against this guy. It's kind of hard, though. This is a hard fight when you can't actually shoot. Maybe I should just not use bombs and only worry about using the, uh, the Tammy's head. Because Tammy's head does a good amount of damage. Maybe just use one bomb and then wait for the head. Or maybe just wait for him to, uh, to come at me and then use a, use a, uh, a bomb when he stops. Oh, well. Careful. Nope! Alright, well, I almost missed that up. Tammy's head actually managed to kill him, and... Uh, I guess we just go on to the next floor. This is looking to be a strange run. So we picked up Guppy's tail. Is it worth it? I mean, yes. I'll use two bombs. It should be enough to kill these guys. Yeah. Uh, it would be easier to kill these guys with the... Uh, the bean, that's for sure. But we have 38 bombs left and two of spades. This is the depths one. Yeah, okay, I think Guppy's head was the right decision there because those enemies, they can be a pain in the ass and they were a pain in the ass for us on a previous floor, but Guppy's head made short work of them. Don't move. Not quite. Not quite able to kill him. Oh wait for Guppy's head, it's almost recharged. And two of clubs! Okay, that makes me feel so much better right now. Because the bomb situation was looking a little bit... stressful. But uh, with the, uh, the extra bombs, we should have no problem being able to finish using as many as we want. 71 bombs basically went us, uh, basically allowed us to get all the way here, excuse me, from the basement, so. And hey, Ghost Baby, not worthless because we can actually shoot. Believe it or not, we can actually shoot now. Not the, uh, not the most damaging item to have, but, you know, having a familiar was kind of what I wanted to have, you know. That was dumb. Honestly, the best familiar, of course, would have been something like... Oh, we might just die here again. Yep. Broken off, though. What? How does, how does this item work? Okay, that was dumb. I don't know how Broken Ankh works, but it's working for us well. Working for us well? It's working out for us quite well because we have, well, three spirit hearts every time we die. I don't know if maybe it just has a chance of not working or if it has a chance of breaking. I wonder if I can get this bomb here. Now nah, I'll just use two. Goat head. I mean, I, I guess it's just worth it, because it's an item. That was so dumb. But Gimpy, thankfully, managed to get me an extra bomb out of that. Not extra bomb, extra soul heart out of that. <laughs> hey, it's, it's an item. All right, with the compass, we'll be able to make our way to the boss room a little bit more easily. We're going to have a bit of a problem with these ghosts, I think, though. Maybe if I can just kind of time using the, uh, the bombs. Or chariot. Ah! I actually kind of messed up on that guy, but we managed to kill two of them. I know I could have also saved the chariot.
All right, war. War is going to be a bit of a pain, that's for darn sure, but there is a tinted rock over here. War, I should say war in the horse state is going to be a pain, because war in the running state is kind of easy when you have bombs. That was dumb damage on my part. And we get three spirit hearts, which is actually really worthwhile. Thank you very much. Deal with the angel. We might actually have a chance of completing this run. All right. Not going to go through that for one chest. Tammy's head, though, doing a number on these guys. I would have loved to have picked up 9 volt, but uh, it just never presented itself to us. Alright, this room is going to be a pain. That was just dumb damage on my part, really. It takes a lot of bombs to just kill the, uh, the hearts, but, you know, what else were we supposed to do? I need to keep using the uh, the ghost baby as well. There's a reason why it was a good pickup, because it gives us a familiar. And that missed. Ghost baby, you can do it. There we go. Jeez. Oh, Some of the damage is. Difficult to avoid when you have to place your bomb, kick your bomb, in order to actually do damage to enemies. It could be worth it. It still might be worth it. It was probably worth it. Okay, um... We can't shoot, so we... I think we're going to take Rotten Baby. Now, we're not going to have a lot of health when we leave. But I'm hoping... I'm hoping that... We will still be able to get another broken Ankh charged to work. It will still keep us alive. That's that's kind of what I'm counting on. Because uh, Rotten Baby does a good amount of damage for those flies, and we can actually deal damage outside of bombs now. So it's it's a great item to pick up, and one I'm very happy for. And I'm very happy that I avoided taking damage there. I'll, I'll take the heart just in case, you know, just in case this doesn't work and we actually need this health to survive. Get out of there. Oh, okay, well, we're back where we started. Not dead, though. And I guess we fight Mom. Oh great, the hardest version of Mom, too. I'll use as many bombs as I have to to try to get this fight completed. Because I I don't know if the... Uh, I don't know if the Broken Ankh is actually going to work. I don't know how it works. That was an okay bomb. Okay, we died. And we just lost. Okay, I guess Broken Aunt gives you a chance to come back. Kind of like how the... Guppy's Collar works. But that's it for that run. I'm um, sorry that that was not a success. Beans! You know, the rest of these runs... Let's see, it's in the cards. That's good. Slow roll, that's good. Waka Waka, that's fine. The host, that's okay. Family Man, that's okay. Purist, that's okay. It's really just beans. Not being able to shoot, only being able to do damage with the the fart. You know, it takes so long to recharge that it's not that good of a run. It might be actually, in my opinion, the hardest run. I know a lot of people don't like Family Man and a lot of people don't like the Purist, but I think both of those are easier than the beans. 
But anyways, thank you for watching. And uh, hey, like the video or subscribe if you're so inclined. It'll certainly help me out and I would appreciate it greatly. I will see you next time. Thank you again for watching and goodbye.